Hey, what's going on, buddy? Yeah, you're here back with more Pokemon Soul Silver Randomizer Nuzlocke. Uh, we did not beat the game over the weekend. I got really busy and I was really tired, and so I apologize. But we're gonna try to go catch Lugia, um, or at least uh, uh, whatever Lugia is. Uh, and if he's really hard, we're gonna Master Ball him because he should be level 45. Um, I just realized we don't have Flash because Flash was just a TM in this game, and so it's not considered a required item, and so it was randomized, and so we don't have it. I think it was a poison jab. So uh, I know how to get there. I just got. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna wing it. Uh, hopefully, I don't have to have the light. I brought. I'm gonna not really go over a team recap because nothing has changed the last video. We're gonna use Beach as our uh, uh, our HM slave because we're probably just gonna replace them with whatever we catch. Hopefully, it's something good. Uh, we're gonna go stock up on some uh, Ultra Balls uh, just in case we want to catch. Uh, the mall without Master Ball, and we're gonna get some repels because we're about to fight a lot of wild creatures, or I don't want to fight. Um, I'll buy a few, I'll buy a few dust balls just in case. Buy three of those. Um, let's see. Probably need some health after that gym battle. Uh, let's buy some Ultra Balls. We have ten already, so let's buy five. Don't want to buy too many. So we're about to be broke. Um, let's buy some. Let's buy four hyper potions. Ooh, run out of money. How much stupid potion? How much stupid potions? Uh, we'll buy five, two. And I need to save our money for the elite four. Um, and we'll buy super repels. Oh, and I'll buy escape rope. Uh, five should be enough. Yeah, I think five should be enough. And we'll buy one escape rope. Okay, so we're not we're not completely broke. Um, wait, did I buy that? Yeah, I did buy that. Okay, so let's get out of here. Oh wait, oh look, our mom has us a gift. <laughs> let's see what it is. Oh, 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 berries. Ooh. I love it. Oh, look, my repel wore off. Oh, oh goodness. Oh, goodness, mother. Uh, so, yeah. Let's fly to the World Islands uh, with our handy dairy. Ah, handy dandy Sarah Cross. Of all the mons I've lost, I'm so glad I haven't lost uh, Sarah Cross, but you know, knock on wood. <laughs> oh, we lost. And we lost Vespa Quinn last episode. She, she sacrificed us to beat Claire, but. She's no longer with us, so I was I was hoping the toxic stall the whole Elite Four. But yeah, I think so. We go down here. We're gonna use a repel. Use a repel. And we're gonna surf with one of our three mons. Come on. Oh it's it's butthead. Oh my gosh, this hurts. This hurts so bad. Oh my goodness. Um, I think it's the, oh, we didn't battle. I forgot we didn't battle all of these trainers. Are you going to Cinewood? I've already been there. I had a quick battle first. Mm. She's probably gonna be like level 15. Oh, her name's Crystal, like the third game. Oh, a 21 Cyndaquil? <laughs> uh, you're dead. Bubbles! Mm -mm. And now uh, you're dead. Ooh, I leveled up. Moving on up. Man, I am slow as crap. I lost that one. Yeah, you did. You did. Oh, there's an item. I never got this. Master Ball. Ooh, it is a ball. I'll save that. I can't believe we skipped that. Who can learn that? I feel like Roseanne can't learn it. Even though she's grass. Oh, uh, you know, wow. No one can learn it. Maybe the new mom we catch in the cave can. Okay. So next time I do a playthrough of a Pokemon game, I'm going to make sure I get my randomize this in order. Go, butthead. Oh, I feel like I don't want to... Okay, good. Okay, so I... I think it's this. Oh, I definitely didn't fight you. 
And the water's warm here. I'm loose. I'm limber. Sure, I'll take you on. He he peed. He peed in the water. Ew. Hey, he's an Elite Four member. He's a Vaporeon. I'm not scared. Because I'm going to karate chop you. Yeah. Right down, you little fin face. Wow, that thing lived. What's its defense? Oh, shoot, don't have water. Oh, it has water absorb. Really? I thought water absorb was his uh, hidden move. Well, extra sensory. Man, this is one tough Vaporeon. And boom. Hero. I'm just gonna keep battling. I ain't scared no burb. Bird. Burb. Uh, we're just gonna waterfall you. Can't believe I'm faster than this thing. Oh, it is level 19 though. Flinch. Man, how are, the, how are these things living? My stab, super strong move. And boom. Uh, some still a decent experience in a much shop. We're just gonna extra sense for you. And boom. Whoa! Much shop looks like to me like a teeny a teenage mutant a turtle, ninja turtle, but he's not teenage and he just doesn't have a shell. That's like how I imagine they would look like if they were little kids. He's like cowabunga dude. Radical. Okay, so I think it's this. Oh, crap. Okay, last one before we get. I'm on my way to World Islands. I'm gonna explore my friends. Where, where's your friends? They didn't drown, did they? That'd be that'd be really sad. She's a bug catcher. There's no water bugs out here. Well, there's surf skit, but you get what, you get what I'm saying. And okay, you better not live. These Pokemon have been living out here. Okay, good. Tell me this little tiny Goldeen's gonna live my karate chop? I don't think so. Up to level 38. Wow, another, another Firo, really? Well, I guess if I was from out in the ocean, I would like a bird Pokemon to fly me back to uh, the land. Um, let's go for Waterfall. Waterfall's stronger. They can flinch. I think. I can't remember what karate chop is again. Is it 65? This thing better not have lived. Okay, good. Critical hit. Yeah! Crit City! What the crit? Crit my pants. And boom, leveled up. I would like to get up to 100 health. And has a Vibrava. I'm just gonna keep battling. I'm just gonna get to 40. Cause I can go the distance. I'm going to waterfall you, cause it's neutral. And you could flip. I like Vibrava. He looks like he's just coming right at you. Like, ah! Like a big bug. It makes me think of that, um. That clip where like that news reporter is like talking and there's like big bug flies in his mouth and he freaks out. That led to Chris Wood's death. <laughs> the fuck is that? Look, I'm, sw I'm floating a little tiny ball. He's gonna, sw he's gonna swim me to safety. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the island, though. I think we had to get off. Then we have to surf again for some stupid reason. Come on. I really hope we didn't have to go talk. Wait, let me make sure I have the silver wing. Uh, it'd be on the key items. Yeah, I had the silver wing. I think that's all you need. I really hope I don't have to go talk to the elite or the uh, kimono girls. I think that's for the bell tower or the burn tower. Okay, we're island. So this is a new zone. So let's see. So I can't. <laughs> oh wait, I turned the repel off. So I guess we'll just have to wait. I think we go this way. Um, there's an item right there. I don't want to try to get it. I think we go down this ladder. Oh, I think we go down this way. Okay, re repair, ah, repel wore off. So let's see what we can get. 
our World Island encounter is, if we can freaking find it, it is, oh, that's dupes, that's shiny dupes, because I, I have a shiny version of that, so we're going to run away from that, because it's fair, and, okay, I have that for sure, because there's, there's a Pokeball beside it. I think I caught that in sea and wood, so that's dupes as well. Okay, third time's a charm. Let's see what we get. And come on, something good, something good. Oh, well, that was our that was our starter Pokemon, uh, Mordecai. So it's uh, extremely dupes. Wow. We, we're just catching everything. We gotta catch them all. We gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all. Well, catch all of them on the first route that we come to. Oh, and a Kabuto. We don't have one of those, and I don't know why, but he is floating very high up in the air. He got some mad ups. I doubt that I'm gonna train this thing. Um, I'm just gonna throw a dust ball. Hopefully, he just catches it. Cause we're in a dark, spooky cave. That did not, uh, that did not work. And he's lowering my accuracy. Um, guess I'll switch to Shark Bait and go for uh, Dragon Rage. Cause he he's got to have more than forty health. I think. I think if they go for a sand attack, when a Pokemon has sand veil, that should just be like making their ability work. Cause that's just, you're just throwing sand at them. So it's like, haha! I mean, because sand veil ups um, evasion and, and sandstorm. So it should like apply to it too. So it's like, haha, you're just boosting my evasion. I think that's how it should work. Okay, I thought. I thought <laughs> oh no, he's got all that health back. It's so weird, Kabuto is just like in the air. He looks like a tick, like just like hopping at you. Like I'm gonna get you. Or like a, I guess a flea hops. You get what I'm saying. It looks like a flea slash tick. It's just like hopping toward you, like I'm gonna get your blood. Just suck it up. Oh. Yeah. Uh so we'll have a kaboot a kaboot tops. Um, this Pokemon lived in ancient times. On rare occasions, it has been discovered as a living fossil. What? Well, I just found a living one. Uh, Kabuto. Um, Kabutops. I could do like Kabut Bottoms. I could do like, um, uh, like Beyblade because he's like top. Um, I don't know, Kabuto, a Kabuto, Mabuto, I don't know. I'm just gonna name him Shredder. I uh, because I don't know, he has a kinda like a his his head looks kinda like a helmet. Like the Shredder helmet. And then when he evolves, and then he has those little sickles to cut stuff, so I don't know. I I, I don't like to put thought into them if I'm not gonna probably use them. Shredder. Look out for Shredder. Uh, but yeah, we caught a Kabuto, uh, unless we evolve him and he's just like a monster. But I'm pretty sure Kabuto evolves at uh, 40. Oh, oops, I forgot that our repel wore off. Oh, gonna hit a Growlithe again. Um, I'll just kill you. You know, oh, uh, I, I didn't get my shiny Growlithe out, but, um,. I wonder if rare color mons follow you. Like, are, are the rare color sprites in the game where they follow you? Because, I mean, I've had the red Gyarados. But I don't think I've ever caught, had a mon in Heart Gold and Soul Silver that was shiny besides the, uh, the Gyarados. I don't know. Um, so I think we'll go down here. Oh, we don't need the, we don't need Flash anymore. Sweet. Well, here's an item. Ooh, a repeat ball. <laughs> We could use that for all those um, Garchomps and um, <laughs> Garchomps and like Gibbles and all that. 
Let me do that. I wonder if there's an item in all these. I saw that Pokeball just now, but I wonder if there's an item among all these freaking... Is he a trainer? Oh wait, I can't get... Man, I wonder where those two items are. The thing, the thing you have. Oh, he's like a monk. Oh, you have it. Please go ahead. You, sir, are the coolest person who has ever lived. So I think this used to be a rare candy right here. I think. Let's see. Okay, yeah, I think it was a rare candy. Uh, does lack of incense lower accuracy? Yeah. Uh, that could be pretty good. Save on that. Yeah, so that's totally down there where you fight uh, Lugia. Man, I bet there's a bunch of good items. Well, there could be a bunch of good items in this uh, War Islands and all these different caves. But I don't have Flash, and I do not want to risk them being berries. <laughs> oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh my gosh, is it because I didn't talk to the freaking Surfer Girl or the Kimono Girls? Oh, I hate myself. Oh. Oh, I hate my life. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I knew it. I knew you had to talk to them. I knew you had to freaking talk to them. Hold on. Well, guys, I will be back. I'm going to go talk to the Kimono Girls. And then I'll show that. And then I'll work back here. I'll cut all this out. Okay, so I uh, I went to the Kimono Girl's house and they, there was only one there and she was like, oh, I'm, a, I'm a dancing girl. <laughs> um, so I went back to Professor Elm. So you might have to go do Elm first. Let's see. Uh, Gator, did you already collect eight badges? That's so cool. The professor is waiting for you. Uh, hi, Gator. You never cease to amaze me. Thanks, you. Thanks to you, my research is going great. Take this as a token of my appreciation. Oh, the Master Ball! Whoa! It's like the third one in this game. The Master Ball is the best. It's the ultimate Pokeball. I'll catch any Pokemon. It'll catch any Pokemon without fail. It's given only to noted Pokemon researchers. I think you can make much better use of it than I can, Gator. Either way, we just had a group of beautiful Komodo girls looking for you. There we go. <laughs> Gator, people are talking about you. I mean, you, yeah, you are. Like, literally right now. I heard you help Kimono Girls. You've been helping all these people. You make me proud to be your friend. <laughs> Whoa. Acquaintance at best. <laughs> Lyra. You're just like, you're just like a fangirl to me. <laughs> the Kimono Girls are waiting for you at the Equity Dance Theater. I was just there. That is a, that is a damn lie. I was just there. Ooh, ooh, you tree, you tree person. I think we have to battle them too. But I guess we'll go there. Yay! Up, up, and away, Sarah Cross. Never ending story. I do think Sarah Cross could learn, or Sarah Cross could learn fly. I mean, it, it literally flew all the time. Oh, I didn't mean to go to the Pokemon Center. Urgh. Oof. Go up here. <laughs> Thud. Uh, how? How is this possible? How can I lose to some mere Komodo girls? Now you were watching me, Gator? Yeah, that's right. I never thought defeating five Komodo girls would be so hard. I got beaten to a pulp. Fiction. You must have right. You must have come here for the same reason, right? Uh, don't get cocky just because you defeated Team Rocket. These Komodo girls are insanely strong. Go ahead, see if you can defeat them. But I'm not going back. I don't want you to see you win. Ooh. He's what he's a he's a bad guy, but he's got a heart of gold. Oh, he's a bad boy with a heart of gold. Oh, here we go. Guess I can't save or anything. Welcome, my name is Suki. I have met you previously in Violet City. In order to bring back Lugia, we need someone with the right bond with Pokemon. We asked Poke Mr. Pokemon to give this mystery egg to whoever showed true potential. The egg was eventually handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm and then to you. However, being pure alone would not be sufficient to face the power of this Pokemon. 
I must test you. Are you ready? Uh... Yeah. I will test how closely you bond with your Pokemon. We'll bring it on, Zuki. Zuko. Technician. Technician. Oh, he has a Beedrill. Oh, wow, level 38. Holy crap. Uh, good thing I know extra sensory. Oh, don't you poison me. Don't you poison me or kill me. Oh, oh my goodness. Okay, good. Whew, that was going to kill me. They're a little tough. Yeah, you're dead. Give me a bunch of experience. Ooh, I better level me up. Ooh, so close. I don't have any Pokemon left. Yeah, you only have one. Yeah, you think you'd fight. Oh, crap. Ye, ye are... <clears throat> you are quite strong. You helped me in Ilex Forest. My name is Nako. Nayako. I'm the one that's not so good at directions. My eyes witnessed you defeating Team Rocket with Kurt was in trouble. The Slowpoke well. Allow me to you... Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Hey, she even asked me. Holy crap. Um. Well, I hope they don't have, like, Pursuit or something. Okay, she's a Pidgeot. I am going to switch out. And I am going to switch into... Either... Butthead or Garchomp? Um, let's go Butthead. I'm gonna say Shark Bait. Shark Bait. Ooh, ah. Get burned. Come on. Ooh, so close. Uh, let's go for Lava Plume. Oh. Glooch! Take that, Pidgeot. Remember when Ash got Pidgeot and then he immediately let it go? Ooh, and you're burning. Be doing less damage. Ooh, trying to increase your speed, huh? It's not gonna matter with my quick claw. Ah, my quick claw. Ooh, this might kill you. Quick claw again. Agility was useless. I like how lava plume just looks like an explosion. And uh, yeah, you're dead. I uh, take that. Level three nine. Oh, you are truly strong. Oh, you are truly strong. I can't remember the voice I give him. <laughs> Hi, you are quite the trainer. I remember you chasing off that Team Rocket grunt right from right there, or here. I must thank you for that. Although I am actually a trainer myself, she who knows the most speaks the least. I am Miki, the Kimono Girl. Well, you know, you've been talking the most, so... Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Yeah, you, you've been so, you, you talked the most out of the girl so far. She's a nine tails. Hmm. I will heal. I can't imagine you going for anything except for a confuse rate. It really make me mad. Super potion. Makes me feel right. Okay, what are you going to go for? Oh, don't you dare burn me. Okay, good. Oh no! Because I was gonna go for status moves. And uh, you're dead. This better kill you. Ooh, it better kill you. You've got it. flinch. Oh wait, never mind. Okay, just in case it burns me, I went for bow beam. Man, this thing must have a lot of HP or defense. And uh, boom, you're dead. What is that? Is that the, the third Kimono Girl? Yeah. Oh, you're good at Pokemon too. I can't remember the voice. It's been too long. I think it was a lot of money. Hi. Excellent fighting spirit. You got me off the ice by pushing me from the back. I am the one who skates in sandals. I am Sile, the Kimono Girl. I was listening to the Dragon's Den when you passed the test of the Elder. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. So there should be one more, right? Have something that my Apollyrath can just... <laughs> she is a male... I like that she is a male cone being because it can't evolve. And so it's like, that's the reason why she doesn't, it hasn't evolved. Oh, it knows Gus. Oh, crap. 
that shouldn't kill me. Oh, okay, good. Oh my goodness, I've, if a combi would have killed my polyrath, I'd have been so mad. Okay, good. Whew, well, I need a heal, because the last thing might have pursuit. I was like, well, this thing... Oh, oh so close, I almost had you. Yeah, you, almost, you, you really did. You really did. I am the last one. You are so dependable. At the Golden Rod Tower, I am the one who dwells even underground. I am the knight. I am justice. I am Cooney, the kimono girl. I look at you and wonder when you thwarted Team Rocket's mission to take over the ro radio tower. I'm out of breath doing this impression. You must show your strength to me now. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. I think I went from kind of like a heavy set to like Batman. And she has a bottom thing. Well, most of the things that we fought is weak to uh, Polyrath, but I'm going to heal just in case this has something stupid. Like, can, can Bonsley and Pseudo learn an explosion? I'm not sure. <laughs> Come on and slam. And I'll take you to the space jam. I'm gonna go for karate chop. This thing is faster than me. And a boom. I think slam and like tackle and like double edge. I think all of them should work how they should work. Is like if a rock Pokemon uses it, it's a rock move. Cause it's like you're like throwing. You are wonderful. Marry me. Uh, but yeah, it should like. It should work like, because you're throwing like a rock at him, or uh, at them. We were not wrong about you. You are indeed worthy of this. Please take it. Okay, yeah, the title, you need a stupid bell to summon Lugia. Big sisters, I just saw the big shadow of a Pokemon on the World Island's waters. It could be. From all the way, all the way over here. Gator, we, we will be at the World Islands. See you there. So let me go all the way back. Uh, I'm gonna heal. And uh, actually, I guess let's go check what mom has to say. She probably bought us like three berries. So let's go get let's go get disappointed. Well, I'm not mad. I'm just disappointed. So let's see. Oh, let's see. Oh, berries. Woo! Oh, let's see. Oh, see what else did Oh, uh, ooh, a muscle band. I have no idea what that does. A anything else? Oh, oh, more berries! Yay! They're not even good berries, which makes me mad. Oh, nope. Well, let's see what a muscle band does. It is an item to be held by a Pokemon a headband that slightly boosts the power of physical moves. Ooh, that could be good. Um, slightly boosts the power of physical moves. I could like get my Heracross burn and then give him that. Ooh pretty good I thought for some reason the muscle band might be like one of those uh, IV trainer things um, I'm gonna heal and I'm gonna, f I'm gonna go back to Lugia so I'm gonna fast forward it so I'm back through this stupid cave we got all the kimono girls we got all the bells let's do this I also it better not be a freaking caterpie it better please be something good that's right. This is where we be we welcome Lugia. We become Lugia, the five of us. When the dance we practice many days become one with the sound of the title bell we entrusted with you, then Lugia shall come out from the deep, deep within the waterfall basin once again. Oh, let's do this. So beautiful. Just the the guardian, the guardian of the sea. But he's a psychic flying. Yay! So beautiful. Come on, you stupid bird. 
actually I'm not sure what he is. He's a bird. <laughs> He's a weird looking seabird. Come on. You do your big old hand wings. I love, like the meme when it shows like Lugia and like Yavalta like flying each other with their hand wings and it says hug me brother because they're like the same thing. One's a dark flying, one's a psychic flying. I remember when I was in like middle school or high school and this game was just so cool. I thought this was crazy. This was such a good, it's, it still is a good game. Oh. Oh. Oh, Lugia, can't wait to have you not follow me, because you're not here. <laughs> this is indeed Lugia, the guardian of these islands from ancient times. So I may have tried again and again, only to fail. Gator, your heart in complete harmony with the title that has finally allowed it to appear. Gator, don't you see? It must have been waiting for you, someone like you, all this time. Would you agree? That's right, Zuki, or whatever your name was. I don't remember. Let's do this. I'm kind of mad that I have to surf to you. Mayor Margot. Wait. Um. Let's put shark bait in front so I can lower the health. Gios! Like I like the two big Pokemon you fight, like Gyarados and. Well. <laughs> It's a victory bell. We, we don't have one of those. Um, we probably could catch this thing without um, a Master Ball. So let's see. Dragon Rage. There's no way you have, you don't have more than 40 health. Yeah, you got, you got plenty of health. Oh, no Sleep Powder. That's not bad. Uh, I think we need like two more Dragon Rages. Good thing about Dragon Rage, you can't like crit or low roll or, or low roll or high roll. Okay, so we can take one more Dragon Whip or Dragon. <laughs> Dragon Rage for sure. Oh, they did a lot of damage. Um, hmm. I could switch to Roseanne, and this thing. I'm like, so I should be immune. I'm, yeah. Oh, I guess Sleep had it. I'm not immune to that because I'm. Because in the new games, you, Grass Pokemon are immune. Uh, Dust Ball go? I'm afraid, I mean, I, I don't think Magical Leaf would kill this thing, but I'm afraid it might have low special defense because of the stats. Oh. Oh. And boom, we don't need it. Um. Yeah, that was, uh, super easy. I hope this thing is pretty good. Victory Bells, that was what added. The horrifying plant... <laughs> it's true, the horrifying plant monster attracts prey with its um, aromatic honey. Then melts them in its mouth. Oh, it's so horrible. So I was trying to do that to James all these years. Um, what is a good name to name this thing? Um, you can name it Petey the Piranha from like Mario. Um, ooh, what was the um? What, did the plant have a name? A little little shop of horrors. Wasn't his name like Audrey? Oh, I think his name was Audrey. Yeah, I think so. Was it? Yeah, I'm gonna name it Audrey. Or Liberty Bell. I don't know. Um. Yeah, let's just name it Audrey. That's a good name. Well, cool. We have a level 45 uh, Victory Bell. I mean, it's a Grass Poison. We have one of those. You know, I would add it to our. I guess we might add to the team. Uh, let's get. Oh, I've got to buy another freaking escape rope. No. <laughs> Wait. Did I? Oh, I did. Oh, I'll be right back again. <clears throat> and I put the uh, victory bell on our party. Um. So, <laughs> I was right. This thing has no special offense or defense. Uh, they're both garbage, 32, 21, but look at its speed, 143, and its attack is 155, and its health is 150. Literally, pretty much its speed, its health, and attack is over 100 more than its level. I mean, of course, the speed is two levels below, but oh my goodness. 
And so this thing knows Vine Whip Stab, Sleep Powder, Sweet Scent, and Razor Leaf. Um, so I'm going to let it keep Razor Leaf. Um, and I think I'm going to teach it uh, Spore, Fly, and Waterfall. <laughs> oh, it can learn Spore, by the way. So if it's that fast, it's going to outspeed everything, and we'll just put it to sleep. So we're going to teach it Spore. Um, I know our team is incredibly weak to... <laughs> Uh, flying. Um, so we're gonna get rid of sleep powder because it will never miss. Uh, I know Sarah Cross learns spore, but I don't want her to learn anything else. Um, we'll teach it. Ooh, wait, not fall. Uh, sir, we'll teach it waterfall so we can get some strong attack. Um, flinches going on. We'll get rid of sweet scent. You know, that's, that move is complete garbage. And we'll teach it fly, just for the heck of it. And if we need to, we can get rid of fly and blackthorn. And we'll get rid of... We'll get rid of uh, bottom whip. And boom, uh, well, our, we have a really strong victory belt. It hits hard, but um, it probably cannot take a hit. Oh, you know what? We'll give it the uh, muscle band, too, so it really increases physical attacks. So it hits super hard. Okay, we'll just we'll just one-shot our way through um, <laughs> the Elite Four. So boom. Um, oh, gosh, look at this thing. Just like a weird banana-looking thing following me. Uh, but yeah, uh, I think I'll, uh-oh, looks like we glitched. I'm going to save it. Well, guys, I think I'm going to wrap it up there. We um, <laughs> we got through the Lugia K, we did all that nonsense, and we got a strong victory bell out of it, and we caught a Kabuto. But next episode, we're going to step our first, we're going to get our first step into Kanto, we're going to head our way to the Elite Four. Uh, I can't remember if you actually do the cave in the beginning or not. I think you might. We'll do the Elite Four cave and then the Elite Four. Hopefully we'll be done with the game so we can move on to other stuff. Uh, sorry it's been so slow. I've been just busy with real life stuff and family. And um, yeah, I've been really tired. So um, I'm going to try to get this wrapped up and start putting more videos back on the channel. Try to do some daily uploads and uh, get everything going again. But uh, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Later Gators.